Uh, it's, re it's really important. I mean, um, I haven't really been watching too much of the Big Ten games this year, but I, I know what, that uh, we only can control what we can control, and, and we're going to go out there and, um, like I said, we're going to play as hard as we can. We're going to try to execute the plan as, as well as we can, and, um, and we're going to try to try to get that win. Billy Brown certainly wanted Ohio State to keep it their end of the bargain in the Big Ten. As Garrett, so far, the Big Ten has not looked good in the bowl season. Both Minnesota and Michigan lost their bowl games. Maryland and Rutgers, who of course joined the Big Ten next season, they lost their bowl games. Four Big Ten teams will play on New Year's Day, and it might be an 0 for 6, 0 for 8 if you want to count Rutgers and Maryland. Yeah, you're right. Uh, you look at a game like LSU-Iowa. LSU is the number 16 team in the country. Iowa uh, kind of limps into the, the bowl season. Uh, you take a look at a game like Michigan-Stanford. That's 4 and 5 in the uh, AP poll. Uh, Michigan State. That's probably the Big Ten's best chance for a win right there. Nebraska, Georgia in the uh, Capital One Bowl. Uh, Georgia without their quarterbacks, uh, Aaron Murray tore his ACL in the last game of the season. So maybe there's a chance there for Nebraska. But you're right, Mark, it could be a very easily an 0 for 6 uh, after New Year's Day for the Big Ten. The Big Ten wants to do better national reputation. They need to do better in the bowl games. Two BCS games, of course, we've been talking about the Ohio State Clemson Orange Bowl game all week. Michigan State Stanford, I think that's probably a good matchup for the Spartans. I think you're going to see two very similar teams. If you want to throw out the old fashioned football moniker, these are two teams that like to run the ball and play physical defense. Well, it's, it's really about as good of a matchup as you could get if you're Michigan State. Stanford is going to try to pound the ball right down your throat. Without Max Bulla for Michigan State, that could be a problem, but uh, they, they have been stout defensively. Uh, it's no secret that that's their strength, and I think that, that, that matchup up against Stanford really works to their advantage. So four Big Ten teams will play on New Year's Day. Ohio State plays Friday. That's going to do it for us tonight on the QP Buckeye Insider from South Florida. No show on Wednesday, but Thursday, 10 o'clock on TV44. We'll hear from Urban Meyer. We'll hear from Dabo Sweeney. We also got some special stories with Ryan Shazier and Carlos Hyde that you don't want to miss. For Garrett Seawright, I'm Mark Hoots. We'll see you next time on the QP Buckeye Insider from South Florida on WOSN.